Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here and in this video, we'll be doing a camera review of the new Samsung Galaxy M52 5G. So Samsung Galaxy M52 5G is the latest M series smartphone with a 64 megapixel triple camera setup and you also get a 32 megapixel selfie camera. So let's see how good the camera performance is for the price segment it is being offered. So before getting into the detailed camera review, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So first let's have a look at the camera hardware. In terms of camera hardware, the Samsung Galaxy M52 comes with a primary 64 megapixel Samsung GW3 sensor with f1.8 aperture, a secondary 12 megapixel ultra wide angle lens with f2.2 aperture and you get a third 5 megapixel macro sensor with f2.4 aperture. Now the selfie camera is a 32 megapixel shooter with f2.2 aperture. So let's see how the camera performance is for the price segment it is being offered. So first let's have a look at the daylight shots. So here you can see that the images are bright with rich colors. They look vibrant and also have great details. The color tones are also good. The colors are a bit richer but not saturated and most people will love the overall quality offered on the Samsung Galaxy M52. They are mostly pleasing to the eyes and comes with good sharpness levels as well which is evident when you pixel peep. The dynamic range is also pretty impressive and resolves shadows pretty well for the segment it is being offered. Overall, the Samsung Galaxy M52 produces some of the best outdoor shots for the price segment, which are crisp, clear and colorful too. Now moving on to the ultra wide angle images, the photos have come once again great with good details as it is a 12 megapixel shooter unlike the 8 megapixel you find on other phones in this segment. The details and colors are pretty similar to the primary camera and here also you can see vibrant colors. The dynamic range is also good. Overall quite good ultra wide angle images are being offered by this phone. Moving to the close up shots once again you can see good details and sharpness levels but the phone has a tendency to saturate the colors a bit. The sharpness levels are good and it is more about color reproduction which isn't accurate but acceptable. The macros with the 5 megapixel shooter turned out to be good once again and produces good results. Now moving on to the portraits, here the M52 does a good job with sharpness, details and colors. While the sharpness levels are good, the skin tones are decently produced although at times it can be slightly yellowish in nature. The edge detection seems to be pretty good. Next the low light images, here the M52 does a decent job in bringing details in the low light images especially with artificial lighting. In extreme low light conditions, the noise is evident but maintains a decent sharpness levels. But night mode helps in bringing down the noise levels. The night mode shots are quite acceptable and details are also pretty good. Now moving on to the selfies, the 32 megapixel selfie camera is quite good and brings good details and also dynamic range is good. The skin tones looks quite natural, also selfies are more of a personal choice. So what do you guys think about the selfies on the Samsung Galaxy M52? There is also portrait selfie mode option available but the edge detection is in perfect here. Finally the video recording, the phone supports 4K at 30fps and the video quality is good, the sharpness levels are good and the details are also pretty good. But unfortunately, it does not support stabilization which could be a deal breaker for few. There is also 1080p at 60fps offered. Once again, the quality is good but no stabilization offered here. The phone also comes with 1080p at 630fps and here again the video quality is quite good and brings in good details. While there is stabilization offered, this is in the best implementation here. The ultra wide angle camera also does decent 1080p videos with good details and sharpness levels and also has stabilization being offered. The phone also supports slow motion and also super slow motion which are quite acceptable in quality. So this is the video recording taken using the front camera on the Samsung Galaxy uh, M52 5G and it can record videos even in 4K resolution so this is the 4K resolution taken with the front camera. 
So this is the front facing camera sample taken with the Samsung Galaxy M52 5G uh, with uh, the 1080p resolution so you can judge yourself how good the clarity of the videos and also the audio output. So that is a detailed camera review of the Samsung Galaxy M52 5G. So summing up, how good is the Samsung Galaxy M52 in terms of camera? The Galaxy M52 is a good package overall as a camera smartphone with great looking daylight shots, ultra wide, macros and portraits and along with decent selfies, the M52 will not disappoint users. The area of improvement would be adding stabilization for the 4K video which would make this device a sweet deal in terms of camera below the 30k price segment. So that was a detailed camera review of the Galaxy M52. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.